Colton Brennan, Product Manager, ALM Positioners. I'm here today at uh, Chesapeake, Virginia. Uh, Chesapeake Yachts, owned by Jack Stevens. He gave us a call a couple months ago with a crazy idea of trying to weld a boat hole on a positioner. I said, yeah, that's no problem, Jack. You know, I'm in, in my head, I'm thinking, small little 15 foot boat, you know, no big deal. His specs were 75 foot long frame, 14 and a half feet wide, and it had to deflect less than three quarters of an inch over the entire length. A couple weeks of design, it turned into a little over a month of design, um, and we built this. Positioner is a 35,000 pound extended travel uh, positioner. It's got uh, 416,000 inch pounds of rotational torque, uh, six foot of travel on the tail stock for adjustability. So you can either change the length of your part or your boat, um, or actually take it out of, out of alignment and, and spin it at an angle. Uh, and with this, you can get the boat, the welds, the assembly, whatever you're doing on it in position correctly. You can cut your time in half. At least that's what it's done for Jack Stevens here, Chesapeake Yachts. The hull itself, we should be somewhere around total finish around 3,000 man hours. First one we built on the ground was 6,000. <laughs> wow. Yeah. Any other facilities that you've been into, I guess, what are they doing? All Same by thing. hand. Same thing you were doing the creepers? The the creepers, solid frames to the floor, climb in, climb out, get the ladders. I was looking through the internet, just looking at different positioners, but uh, it's been really good. It's been uh, surprising to me how much better it has made everything well quality. Yeah. The guys work so much better than being so tired, three o'clock in the afternoon, they're ready to quit. We've been here to afternoons, five and six o'clock at night, and don't even realize what time it is. So it's, it's just made it so much better. And the boat's gonna be 64 feet by 16 feet wide be about 20,000 pounds on top of the cradle when we take it off. And the cradle itself weighs about 13, 13, 13, 8, I think it was, somewhere around there. Anybody that walks in this building, the first thing they do, their mouth comes open, can I take a picture? Right. <laughs> well, I almost did the same thing. <laughs> That's right. It's Christmas. <laughs>